New at five, a rude awakening for some residents in Green Valley Ranch. A crazed home invader breaking windows in two separate homes this morning, entering one of them where there were three kids inside. 7 News reporter Lance Hernandez talking with those victims. And Lance, fortunately, those youngsters were asleep. Fortunately for them, Teresa, their neighbor, who's a sheriff's deputy, was not asleep. He was about to go down to Home Depot when the intruder entered his yard here in the Green Valley Ranch area and shattered his front window. My son was taking care of his animals, and all of a sudden, a window breaks. The deputy's wife told 7 News that when they looked up, they saw a man with a brick outside the broken window cursing in Spanish. She says her husband grabbed his gun, went outside, and tried to stop the man as he ran through a neighbor's yard to a house two doors down. I heard yelling out here. It was like, get down the ground, get down the ground. 15-year-old so Kijana Phillips was asleep on his couch when he heard the commotion. He got up, saw a man yank the screen off his front window, then hit it with his fist. He picked up that pot, tried to break it, picked up the rake, tried to break it. And that's why he just picked up the other flower pot and just busted it up. Black male, black shirt, black pants, now inside the house. Phillips says the intruder climbed through the broken window and began stumbling around, getting blood on the walls, carpet, and furniture. I was pretty scared at the time, you know what to do. I was nervous. But I mean, I was, I was trying to actually keep my friend safe and my brother. The teenager says he picked up a car sweeper and hit the intruder a few times, then ran upstairs to warn his brother and his friend. Now, police tell us that Phillips says when he saw his neighbor, the deputy outside, he went down and let him in. We are told the deputy held the intruder at bay until police arrived. Now, police say that man's not giving them his name, so they're going to have to use his fingerprints to try to identify him. Once he's out of the hospital where he's being treated for uh, cuts from that broken glass, he will likely be charged with burglary and criminal trespass. In Green Valley Ranch, Lance Hernandez, 7 News.